Check back in with Tim now for another look at our real-time forecast. Hey there, Tim. Hey Vince, we've got a few dry hours to enjoy on this Sunday. As a matter of fact, the first half of the day should be fairly dry, but some scattered storms developing later on this afternoon to this evening. Both today and tomorrow we're going to see some of those. I think even more coverage during the day, probably on Monday, but some dry time today especially. A cool change early next week. Highs only in the 70s, maybe some 40s for lows come Wednesday morning, and then back into the 80s by Friday. So if you like it warmer, you don't have to wait too long. We're going to warm things up towards the end of next week. Right now we're starting off in the upper 60s at O'Hare. It's now 69, 60 68 degrees up in Waukegan, a little cooler south, 63 degrees right now in Kankakee. We've got some clouds out there. We've got a west-southwest breeze, kind of light, about 5 to 10 miles per hour. It did allow for some fog to form. Visibilities are improving, though, up to about 6 or 7 miles at Aurora, and also it's 7 miles at Juliet, so things are getting a little bit better in terms of fog. We'll see some peaks of sun here and there. We'll see some gusty northeast winds kick in tomorrow behind a cold front, and that's going to mean a couple of things. It's going to whip up some big waves, southern end of Lake Michigan, up to 6 to 8 feet possible by late tomorrow afternoon in general, about 4 to 7 feet and also some strong rip currents, so watch out for that. There's a beach hazard statement late tonight all the way through Wednesday morning. Showers moving off to the north and east, drying out now it looks like, other than a slight chance for a spotty shower, but a cold front and upper-level wave is going to dive southeastward, head our way towards this afternoon, combined with some afternoon heating. That means some scattered showers and thunderstorms popping up for us at times. Our real-time satellite radar tracker brings those in just after 1 o'clock this afternoon through about 6 or 7 o'clock this evening. Some showers on and off tonight, and then some more showers, I think, on and off during the day on Monday. Now a complete washout. We'll get some dry time. Highs today, low 80s. Tonight's lows will get down to the 60s. Tomorrow's high temperatures only in the mid 70s. So your forecast for today, looking for a high of 82, but scattered afternoon storms. In your seven-day forecast, we're looking at a cool down. 76 on Monday, 75 on Tuesday, 79 on Wednesday. Good chance for showers, looks like, during the day on Monday. Here comes that warm-up towards the end of next week. Highs in the 80s beginning on Thursday, 81 on Friday. Maybe an isolated thunderstorm. We're looking for a high of about 85 degrees during the day on Saturday. So it was a very warm July. Temperatures above average every day. It's going to cool down tomorrow.